Mountain View Invitational, uh, traditionally a very good tournament for Indiana University. Uh, it is a strong Midwest field. Uh, we got some great teams there. Colorado, Iowa State, Oklahoma, Arkansas coming off a big win down at LSU. Texas Tech, Gonzaga, Minnesota playing very well. San Jose State is always tough, a, a perennial West, uh, Western Athletic Coast Conference champion. Baylor's good. Uh, Nebraska um, on the eve of their Big Ten debut. Uh, Kansas, uh, Oregon State, Wyoming, Missouri, Texas State, and Kansas State round out the field. So it's a, it's a very strong field. Um, a lot of teams all in the same situation, kind of looking at regionals, fighting for regional berths. So a very, very good opportunity for us to, uh, to pick up some ground. Presenting Indiana University is going to be uh, Lauren Gazeki playing in the one spot her first time, coming off uh, a career best uh, tournament in uh, Phoenix. Lindsay Game, uh, Kristen Kane, Jackie Edge, and Kate Coons round out the, uh, the lineup for Indiana. Well, LG um, just, you know, just played a great tournament. Um, you know, we try to tell the girls all the time that it's not about how well you hit it, it's about how well you score. And, and Lauren really played a, a, a very smart event where she just hit the ball in the fairway, got it on the green, she putted well, she didn't do anything super extraordinary, she didn't do anything really bad, she just kept it around the hole and, and converted when she had the chance and, and, and shot some really good numbers. And actually had a chance to really post something uh, much lower. Um, so I know that she's excited about heading to Mountain View. She had a, a breakout tournament there last year. And I think she's got some real positive momentum heading, in, heading into this well, event. We're, we're, you know, closing in on our lineup, obviously. We're trying to figure out who's going to be in the four, five, and six spots. And then we're really trying to just put the pedal down here. It's, it's time for us to, to, you know, kind of hit our stride, which we typically do about this time of year. We've had enough time outside where we're a little bit more comfortable but, um, you know, just showing up our mistakes, trying to be really good from 80 yards in, which uh, has been kind of a bugaboo for us, and just trying to be as efficient as we can converting. And that, that's going to be our key this week, where we have a, a shorter type golf course, um, you know, lots of wedges, lots of scoring opportunities. And if we can just um, be probably 50% conversion and above, we're going to do really well. We're going to place in the top five of the tournament and, and hopefully throw in a couple of top ten finishes, maybe even have one of the girls win it. So uh, that's, that's what I'm looking for out of this tournament. Our Invitational gives us an opportunity to watch everyone play. It's, it's kind of really our last big qualifier before we hit into Ohio State and in the, in the conference championship. Um, you know, coming out of Mountain View, we'll have a really good idea of, of the top part of our lineup. And what, what we're trying to do is just trying to get... Um, good at, at the two areas which seem to be kind of the, the problem areas for us, which is is under 15 feet conversions for birdies and and just general scoring with with our scoring irons, anything from an 8 iron to a sand wedge. And, and I think, uh, you know, with us having familiarity at Otter Creek, uh, we've played Ohio State's golf course enough. I mean, those are really good opportunities for us to really, you know, look and try to be much better at converting and much better at making those putts so that we can uh, have a successful regional and, uh, and Big Ten championship.